Well, good day, everybody. I hope you've all had a great week. Well, you know, this week the market still seems to be going gangbusters with some outstanding results being achieved throughout the inner west last weekend. Clearance rates are still really high compared to, the, say, like three months ago. And I think the biggest driver of this at the moment is just the distinct lack of stock currently on the market. And especially now that we are entering at what is normally our peak time for selling real estate. I sold an awesome home on the weekend at 19 Balfour Street, Dulwich Hill. That achieved the highest price this year in that area. It sold for an amazing 2.825 million, which is well and truly above my vendor's expectations. You know, look, I really can't see the market changing too much at the moment, unless a lot more stock does come onto the market. The other bit of news this week is that you know, the Department of Fair Trading, like, they've been having a bit of a crackdown on agents, and apparently they've imposed uh, over 400,000 in fines throughout the industry for various breaches. Now, you know, I know one of the biggest bones with buyers at the moment is trying to get an accurate price guide from agents and it's something, well, and it's sometimes very, very difficult to gauge the actual value of a home when buyers do push prices well beyond vendors' expectations. Now, unfortunately, like, this only happens when the market is really strong and sometimes it's really out of the agent's hands as to what a property is really worth. You know, the funny thing is the reverse happens when the market's on a downturn. Agents will give you a guide and then the opposite happens and you start to see houses are selling for less than the original guide given to you. Now, I really think that the best way for any potential buyer to get a really good understanding of, them, of the value of homes, look, just get out there and try and see as many homes as you possibly can, even if they're not in your price bracket, you know, and get to as many auctions as possible, and then you'll start to get a good feel for the market and what property really is actually worth in any given market. Look, anyway, that's it for this week, so until then, see ya. Bye for now. Yeah.